Hi everyone, um, Warren Ballantyne here um, with Rob Meelan from uh, Australian Accounting and Franchising Practice. I'm just asking Rob a few, um, I, I think, super important questions about one, franchising, but franchisees that are going into a franchise. So um, the interesting thing is there's lots of different questions from different people, right? Yes. Tell me what the most successful franchisees um, appear to do to make the right decisions to go into a franchise that they've never had anything to do with before. G give, me a, give me a bit of an overview of what it looks like when, you, when the, the guys are asking all the right questions, what sort of questions, and they're very, they, they appear to be very successful at what they're doing. Okay, I'm going to throw a different analogy, Warren, because I think I'd like to use you as the example. I know you've been married to your good wife for many, many years, but you didn't propose to her the day after you met her or when you met her at first sight, did you? Close. Close, so but no, you didn't. didn't no. But that's the trick. It was a couple of weeks. We can see things that are really exciting and we get excited and we love about it. And it's like franchising. Franchising is very infectious and it's great to get involved. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't mean you have to buy it today. You don't have to join the franchise today. Mm -hmm. That's where the most successful franchisees use a combination of emotion and their head as well. And it's mm -hmm. more than just heart. Heart is where you find out whether I'm right to be part of that franchise and that franchise is right to be part with me. But then the second part is making sure the black and whites are there. Are the numbers right? Are the figures right that the franchise all can make money and that me as a franchisee can make money and we all can make money so we all have a good day and a good week and a good life. Now that's where the homework's gotta be done. And it comes back to the classic scout motto of be prepared. You've got to prepare for an adventure, and franchising is an adventure, so you've got to pack the right gear, which means getting the finance right, getting the people right, getting your family right, getting the support network right, getting the right advisors. But the good franchisees take the time to get this right, and they hold back that purchase decision until they get everything right. And when they're going right, 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 you know they're right. And guess what, when they start, they're really right and they're right to go. And that's <coughs> what a good, successful franchisee can do. That's fantastic. Thanks, Rob. Thanks well, for coming in. Sure.